focusing on access more if we're talking about the future. Right. You know, we, uh, we recently released this loon project which was using balloons to do it. It sounds totally crazy. Yeah, yeah we can show in the video here. But uh, it actually, two out of three people in the world don't have good internet access now. Three, two, and we actually one. think this can really help people. Uh, and if it sort of cost efficiently. It's a balloon. Yeah, get access to the internet. Yeah. And, and why, why does this balloon give you access to the internet? Because there were some interesting things you had to do to figure out how to make balloons possible. They didn't have to be tethered. Yeah, and this is a good example of kind of innovation. Like, we've been thinking about this idea for five years or more before we started working on it. But it's just really, how do we get access points up high cheaply? Yeah. And normally you have to use satellites and it takes a long time to launch them. But you saw there how easy it is to launch a balloon and get it up. And actually, again, it's the power of the internet. I did a search on it and I found 30, 40 years ago, someone had put up a balloon and had gone around the earth multiple times. Yeah. I thought, why can't we do that today? Yeah. And um, that's kind of how this project got But are you at the mercy of the, of the wind? Yeah, but it turns out we did some weather simulations, which probably hadn't really been done before. And if you control the altitude of the balloons, which you can do by pumping air into them mm -hmm. in other ways, you can actually control roughly where they go. Mm -hmm. And so I think we can build a worldwide mesh of these balloons mm -hmm. that can kind of cover the whole planet.